Tom, please don't do that. You have no idea. Enough. Come on, drive the truck, please, Tom. Put your phone down. Thank you. Oh, it's two, two. Oh, there's two of them. and the mom and the dad are doing it too. They're right on the edge of the mountain here, on the outside of the guardrail, throwing rocks. Yep, smart, huh? Uh, I'm just taking videos so I can post them to YouTube when they fall, when they off. fall off. Yep. The kid threw and almost fell over. Yeah. And mom's taking pictures, if you can imagine. So nice. Well, I hope, there, they're still throwing rocks. Come on, folks, be smart. And watch your children, please. I'm getting nervous. It doesn't have to be the Grand Canyon to kill them. Oh, no, they're going back under. Sorry. Okay. Where are we now? They're gone. We'll take care of their dog, okay? This is one of the most dangerous roads we have ever, ever been on. We have been forewarned many times about this, and Tom's going to get us down alive. If not, whoever finds this camera, tell our kids we love them. Right, Tom? Right. <laughs> oh, God, I think I'm going to die. Okay. Tom's a good driver. He's chomping on his stogie. I got everything I need. What, what, I got my food. What I got speed my are we going? What speed are we going? 97. No, slow it down. <laughs> I reason I, everybody, oh, MG, the reason I'm saying this is... You're going too fast. 40 miles an hour is tops on this, and you go straight off into the mountains if you, you start going back and forth too fast. You just lose control, and you, you're a goner. So, we are going to take this 40 miles at 35 or less, Tom. Right? That's right. All right. And it's all on TV here. It's all on cable. Not cable, but video. So like I said, if we die, whoever finds this camera, my daughter's number is written on a book in the car. Bye. Okay, this doesn't look as bad as they made it sound. But we haven't hit it yet. <laughs> as you can see, the grate is pretty steep. 7%. And, uh, oh, I think we're going to be good to go here. Hmm. Well, it's cat if the catch 
what is it called? The catch net. Catch net is the similar that the similar thing that they use to catch an air. <laughs> All right, this is a. It's a certain. <laughs> It's a similar thing they use to catch an airplane when it lands on a on a, a boat, <laughs> an aircraft carrier. So you know it's like a slingshot. If you miss it, <laughs> yeah. Okay, I think we're doing fine, Tom. How fast are we going? Thirty-seven. Thirty-seven. You're really pushing it. Go down to thirty-five, and I'll feel better. I'll stop whining. Thank you. Isn't he a good man? He's a wonderful guy. He doesn't want to listen to his wife whine. The catch net cable system. Never heard of him before. We've been on many mountain roads. Um, yeah. Right. If you keep going too fast and you can't slow down, you better get your ass into that catch net cable system. Because it says otherwise you're off the side of you're just going off the side of the mountain period in the paragraph. Um, yeah, and I'm looking at treetops here, so we're pretty high up. We were higher today. We got up to 96, almost 10,000 feet. Catch net is open. Well, that's good. No one went into it yet. <laughs> good, it's Catch available. Net. Catch net is available. If you need it. Okay, is that it coming up that's here? That's it right here. Okay, here's the catch net. It's available. I don't think we need it. Tom is doing a great job of keeping everything under control. But that's what a catch net looks like. It's a it's it's not a ramp. They usually have those that um, runaway ramps, but they don't have them here because of the way the mountain is built. And the switchback is so tight that they had to devise this system. Well, wait a minute, I just lied because guess what? There's a runaway ramp. And that's a really tall one. Boy, it looks if you hit that time, you go crash your front end. Right? What? That runaway ramp there. That's a pretty steep runaway ramp. Oh, that one? Yeah. yeah. that's the old one. It didn't work. <laughs> that is a runaway ramp right there, yeah. Okay, so now... All right, so we've passed the one thing that... Here comes the, the here, 40 mile an hour curve. Okay, and go down slower. Okay. Here, here's the dangerous part that they warned us about, and that's why I'm videotaping this. If you were going too fast, you wouldn't be able to con get yourself corrected in time. I'm still pretty high. These are these are pretty high treetops of some pretty tall um, pine trees. Okay, here we go. Worse. I've seen a lot worse. Yeah, how about the time we were on top of a mountain and one half of a road, just like this, one half, like the one we're driving on, washed away down the mountain and we were on the other side against traffic and dirt. Dirt. Old pavement. And they had to guide us down. And those switchbacks were worse than this by far. And it was dirt. It was a dirt road, really. Basically, it was not well, well done. Are we done? Done. Seriously? That was it. That was the big brouhaha. Yeah. No, there's another one, right? No, that was it. Wow. And up ahead is our destination. Therefore, that must be. Oops. Hello. That's Buffalo, and that's where we're going to finally get out of this damn rig and in it all day. Or we could go to the Deer Park. No, thank you. I got one of those at home. <laughs>